Welcome to WAM Group. The new aluminium alloy slide valve, manufactured by WAM, adds to its already proven technical performance, an innovative seal replacement system. This video will guide you through each step of a proper maintenance procedure. Enjoy the video. Replacing the worn seal. Position the valve with the flanged support downwards. Remove the drive side screws using a screw gun. Place the valve in vertical position to prevent the nuts from falling. Then slip the drive side out with a rubber hammer if needed. Using one of the screws, remove the nuts on the half body, first from one side. Then from the other. Position the valve with the bearings upwards, to have them disassembled. Unscrew the nuts, bolts and bushes of the blade support to remove the bearings. Slip the blade out. Flip the valve on its lower side, the bearing side has to face downwards. Unscrew, all the screws of the half body with a screw gun. Lift the seal on each side by rotating the valve body. Flip the half body. Remove the upper half body using a lever. Remove the seal. Pay attention to the seal frame, keep it pushed down. Before starting reassembling the valve, make sure all the nuts are in their seat. Fitting the new seal. Withdraw a new seal. Place it on the valve, and consider that the seal spout, has to be positioned towards the entrance of the blade. And the bore's position have to match the bearings. Fit the seal on the inner side of the half body. Grease the nuts of the remaining half body to avoid they get worn. Make sure the seal is well positioned and fixed. Fit the other half body inside the seal. Ensure the two half bodies are aligned. Flip the valve body so that the nuts stay on the lower side. Lift the seal and insert the fixing screws of the half bodies. Do not tighten them. Tighten completely the screws with a screw gun. Fit the bearings and the bushes on the screws. Place the valve vertically and fit loosely the screws, the bearings and bushes to the seal.
seat the valve down and fit loosely the external screws, bearings and bushes. Seat the valve down, and position it, making sure that the edge has the radius directed upwards, with respect to the bearings, which have to be in lower position. Grease the blade. Fit the blade in. Flip the valve so that the bearings are in top position and tighten them completely, using a torque wrench. Position the valve vertically and grease the fixing nuts of the metallic parts. Take the metallic part and fix it to the flange support of the piston on the bearings side. Place it on the bench, and insert the screws loosely on one side. Tighten them with a screw gun, and repeat the operation on the other side. The valve is now ready to be used. Thanks for watching.